Hi, I'm Elizabeth Townsend Gard um, from Just Want a Quilt, a research podcast coming out of Tulane University Law School. Today we have a video, a video, um, and we're doing a sew along, a sew along where Gigi Bai will be leading us through Jen Kingwell's The Gypsy Wife Quilt, which is awesome. Um, so these are videos that Gigi will produce um, and help us understand how to do it. And Corey Dutton, um, a law student, is going to learn to quilt. So um, it's for beginners, advanced people, even law students. Um, and it will be great. So uh, I hope this helps. So where do you find the pattern? Um, Jen Kinkwell's pattern can be found at Amazon. It's again called the Gypsy Wife Quilt. It's super popular. You can also get it at Uptown Needle and Craftworks here in New Orleans. Just um, look them up online and call them or at any quilt shop. So get the pattern and join us. Welcome to section six, the one that I think everybody is dreading the most because there's so many blocks. I think I counted there's 19 blocks, but we have from September 16th until October 14th to get them done. So, and hopefully we can kind of um, streamline it so when we're doing our square and squares we get them all done at one time and that will help us feel a sense of accomplishment. I'm going to start with the two big blocks and we'll start with the nurse's cross. So um, we are able to paper piece the nurse's cross and it will end up being an eight inch block when we're done. The um, foundation paper piece comes from Christy Leah of Quiet Play and it's um, We've got permission from Jen Kingwell to use it. And so um, if you go to Gnome Angel, and we'll have the link to the paper piecing on the, um, our webpage, it, um, it will just help, I think, for us to do this because there are a lot of pieces in this one. Um, and we'll just take it piece by piece and we'll just you know, paper piece it on through. I um, have hung up all my squares. There is no rhyme or reason for how I hung them up. It's just how they fit. Um, and there's some that are double and duplicate because I've had to make two because they're not the right size. But I just put everything up there. Um, and I'm liking the way it looks. I feel like I have a lot of navy and a lot of green. So I think I need a little more red. And, um, and then I'll start thinking about what maybe my strips are going to be. I think I'm going to go with strips that are um, lighter, I think. But once I lay it out and see, I might change my mind and have a couple of darkers in there also. I'm loving seeing what everybody is doing. It's amazing how each one looks so different. And it's all from the same pattern, which is why I love this pattern. Um, so we'll start with the Nurse's Cross. It's on page 14. And then we'll go to the Indian Hatchet, which is on page 12. And then we'll go into the ones that are we've already done, like the pinwheel and the bordered pinwheel, the hourglass, the bordered hourglass the courthouse steps, the square and a square. And some will paper piece because the square and squares are so easy for me and they come out um, more exact and more precise when I paper piece them than if I just wing it. So I'm gonna try that and see how that works. And uh, you know, again, this is your project. You do it the way is most comfortable for you. We're just here to try and cheer you on and keep us all on track so we all end up with a quilt. Some people are going really fast too. Some people are through section six, added all their strips. So that's great. It's fun to see what they've done and learn from them. One little thing that I have been told that in my schedule on section seven, I have that we do a square and a square, um, three and a half inches. There's two of those and I didn't put two. When we went through and labeled everything in our pattern booklet, we did say two, but I didn't put it on the schedule. So you may want to go to section seven and add that there are two three and a half inch square and a squares for that section. And we also have that in this section, we have seven of them. So if you want to go ahead and do a whole bunch of them and get them all done, that's fine too. So it's up to you. Um, just have fun doing it. This is Elizabeth Townsend Guard from Just Want a Quilt. You've been listening to Gigi Bai. Take us through an aspect of the Gypsy Wife Quilt by Jen Kingwell. Make sure you get the pattern. You can get the pattern at Amazon or Uptown Needle and Craft Works here in New Orleans or at your local quilt shop. Um, you need the pattern to be able to understand what's going on. And then um, Gigi helps us through it. So join us. Come play with us. Come to our Facebook group, Just Want a Quilt. Uh, go to our website and be part of our newsletter where we'll help you through the Gypsy Wife Quilt. Um, that's justwannaquilt.com, spelled W-A-N-N-A, just want a quilt. 
Um, and of course, listen to our podcast. It's available on iTunes, Stitcher, Spreaker. And if you can't a chance to like it on those, it would be super awesome. 